Wow, this is a blast from the past. August of 2005, nomination candidate, and this was my website. I'll have to show you, there's some pretty famous people in here actually. Um, it was a really exciting day. It was my first nomination uh, fundraiser, and uh, Tom Bennett arranged it for me, and I had some famous people there. So Bill uh, Tupper, Bill was the longtime uh, Reeve uh, in Rito, and then he became an MP under uh, Brian Mulroney. He's responsible for the uh, statue of Queen Elizabeth on Parliament Hill. Uh, funny enough, uh, Bill um, was also from Pictou County, Nova Scotia, just like me, and he endorsed my candidacy almost off the bat. Now that's Terry Kilray. Terry had run for mayor. Um, who's not in this photo, have, however, is our current mayor, Mark Sutcliffe, was also at the event. Uh, the next is, uh, is um, Gordon uh, O'Connor. Gordon was the defense minister under Stephen Harper, and he represented part of the old uh, Nepean and Carlton riding, so I had Stittsville and Goulburn. Um, Goldie represents that now. Of course, that's me. Uh, the guy beside me, I think he might become Prime Minister of Canada very shortly. That was Pierre Polyev. Uh, a lot of people know I ran his campaign in 2004, and then when it came time for the seat to, to be won here provincially after John Baird left, um, Pierre endorsed me and worked really, really hard. So we've got a very strong relationship over many years, and of course, uh, we're very proud of him here. And the guy beside him was the current MPP for Nepean. He was the candidate for the Ottawa West Nepean Conservative Party, John Baird. Uh, so it was interesting to, to see him there. And the other person that was at that event but wasn't there that day um, was uh, Peter McKay, who was the co-founder of the Conservative Party of Canada. So it was kind of a, a who's who of the conservative movement uh, that backed my candidacy back in uh, 2005. And of course, so the rest will be history. Here I am in 2024, and uh, the longest serving woman at Queen's, Par Queen's Park, and the longest serving MPP, and almost one of the longest serving politicians in our nation's capital. So very exciting, and all you had to do is enter there, and uh, no one knew what the pages of that uh, website would bring, but here we are with 18 years worth of material. Some good, and some we might think cringeworthy.